A lot of my customers are telling me now that their IoT sensors are difficult to use, complicated to install, unreliable, and they don't scale. I want to share with you today a little bit about the Meraki Cloud Managed Sensors and how they can actually help prevent loss, damage, and downtime to your business critical environment. So my name is Gary Daly. I look after the Meraki business for Ireland and Scotland. I'm going to attempt to do this in one take, not that you'll know, but what I'm going to talk about is a Meraki sensor. So this is our MT10, which is in a uh, temperature and humidity sensor. And I've got the box here and I'm going to demonstrate the Meraki app, the new app that you should all be able to get now. So on the left hand side, you're going to see my phone screen. On the right hand side, you're going to see my internal network. And all I'm going to do is I'm going to get my phone. I'm going to go to devices and I'm going to scan new device barcode. So I've got to get the lighting just right here. So hopefully this doesn't take too long. So I'm going to scan the barcode here and there we go. So now I'm going to onboard this particular Meraki device. So it's a new sensor MT10. I'm going to name it MT sensor one. There we go. And I'm going to hit done. So now we've added it to the dashboard and I'm going to hit done again. Now I'm going to unbox it. So when you unbox your Meraki device, you're going to see what it looks like here. It's pretty sort of small and compact and you have to add the batteries. Now the batteries do come with the actual sensor. So I'm going to plug these in and there we go. And you'll see the light is turning on there. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually just going to hit the button once I see the light sort of do its thing and that it's, uh, there we go. So I'm going to hit the button once. So we push the button. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually refresh my network now. So if I go into the test network, you'll see environmental has popped up on the left hand side, which is your know, new tab on your Meraki dashboard. So I'm going to go into environmental now. I'm going to click overview. And what we'll see is this is dormant at the moment. So I'm going to give it a few minutes just to connect to my Meraki camera, which has BLE in it. And this is how they connect. So it uses either Meraki Wi-Fi 6 access point or a camera as the actual gateway. So it uses BLE. So I'm just waiting for this to connect and to find the gateway. And there we go, it's online. And that took a little less than two minutes.